are wearing it. Ade has the pants on that are coming up. In that charcoal, isn't that gorgeous? Blair has it on with that classic Joan pencil skirt. And the easy pay is leaving us at the end of the day. So when we get to midnight West Coast, this easy pay will be gone. Now, if you're getting the color that Ade is wearing, and she has those beautiful gray top fine pants coming up, Love that's those. called the mink. Yep. And that is actually at a lower price. So the mink, it's just a color that we're like marking down for you at $78.96. What an awesome buy, $15.79 a month on Easy Pay. If you are getting the two colors that are new for this gorgeous season, the stunning cranberry or the black. And you know what, David? I do something on mm. Facebook called Cardinal Blessings. Yes, so yes. I often think about putting up my Joan Rivers Cardinal pin. I think you still have Cardinal, cardinal ornaments pins. from the home collection mm, from me. Thank Absolutely. You, David <laughs> um, this is just the perfect cape to buy now, wear now, but wear for holidays. So the oh, black and the that. cranberry is gonna be five easy payments of $20.80, and then the mink you see here, and that's also on a day, will be five easy payments of only, I think it's like $15.79. Okay, wow, you love amazing. this cape. It's awesome, and guys, if you haven't tried a Joan Rivers cape, ladies, this is a very different experience. I mean, you've tried on capes where you, you put them on and they travel around a little bit or there's no place for your arms to go, no place for your hands. We are basically putting out a button up or snap up the front, belted pockets cape look. Are you gonna throw it on? Yeah. Let me help you because so, this is so this. No chic on. No sleeves, which nope, is nope, you're what just I gonna love go right in the armhole. Because a lot of the sleeves now are so big and wide and voluminous, mm -hmm. I find that I can't get them into some of my coats. And, 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 and that's a challenge, even for like loose outerwear. Sometimes you can't get your, you know, your, 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 your heavier sweaters in. This is sleeveless, guys, but what it has is that gorgeous little cape detail. It's basically a sleeveless coat with a fabulous cape. And by the way, a cape that makes you look skinny, I'll take it. Yeah, I think it's very you. slimming. I think it's very attractive. We kept it not as long as a traditional cape mm -hmm. either. So it's very sportswear. It's very wearable now, which I love. And the fabric is so delicious. This is a Melton cloth. So it's got that hand of like, again, of like a beautiful boiled wool or a cashmere hand. It's gonna wear like iron. And by the way, when I see the mink color, I think, oh gosh, it's gonna get dirty, it's outerwear. Machine wash. Machine wash. Machine wash, yeah. outerwear cape, guys. That's I mean, crazy. Do you remember our friends at Kirk's Folly? They're back! Yeah. Are oh they? Oh my gosh, they're oh, back. Oh, that's Let's awesome. The girls. And they have this really cute, like, pumpkin themed jewelry that if you wanna get the mink and wear it to homecoming, mm -hmm. wear it to, like, oh, maybe like a little, like, Christmas get to, I mean, I mean, Christmas, come on. Thanksgiving get together. Don't you feel so chic in this, ladies? Like, just like impossibly chic. There's something incredibly, like, runway, Madison Avenue about the idea of this it's belt turn around and show the back a day because it's belted so you're going to get a suggestion of your waist it's not like that nanny and the professor kit <laughs> where it's like you're wearing this big thing with a neck hole cut in it and it travels your arms are free to carry your bag your arms are free to carry whatever you're carrying you're getting that chic cape feel and it's like, again, like nothing else in your right, closet. Right. There isn't anything in your closet that has this drama to it. And I love it. Think and of the pockets. Th and think of the things you do. I'm just thinking, especially holiday. Like what happens where you live that you do? Like we always go to the light show. I'm going to still say at Wanamaker's. Oh, yeah. No, it's not Wanamaker's <laughs> anymore, right? Okay. Right, right. So you go downtown and you go have lunch and then you go into the store and you see the light show and then you do a little shopping and you go through the village of, of uh, you know, um, what, a Christmas carol. If you have a coat on, you are miserable. So this is something for those nutcracker Love times that are yep. going to hear the Messiah. This is something that you, well, you're going to wear it all the time, but it's so appropriate for when you're in and out, in and out, in and out sure. of the car and beyond. And I also love that I would, I would put this with a pair of boyfriend jeans right. in a heartbeat, and then I would put it over a very dressy little black dress. Do you and know here I mean? it is not belted. Some, and unbelted, it's also sensational. But hard sometimes to like, what do I wear over my dressy outfit? Right. What do I wear over my good black dress? A little fabulous cape is a mm -hmm. Amazing. Amazing. And then what do I wear with when I've thrown on my my jeans? I've got a cool, maybe Lori Goldstein shoe that's coming up next. Talk the about some fabulous shoes. Footwear, oh yeah, and you're show. wearing the black one, which I, I love. Am. Shoes look awesome. Lori, if you're watching, 
Bravo. Lori. Bravo. Yay. She's got great boots. I've got jeans and boots. Awesome. A Joan Rivers a turtleneck. Boom. Boom. Okay. And anything under a boyfriend shirt would be fabulous under here. One of our mock turtlenecks would right. be amazing. Actually, Adea is wearing a mock turtleneck in the very same color as the new charcoal pant. And again, that's that Joan head to toe dressing, that column of color. Mm -hmm. And then what goes on top that puts you on the best dress list? This cape. And that's the mink color. And honestly, it's more towards a camel, wouldn't right. you say, than a right. mink? It just, is. just as a correct. If you're looking for that perfect Ralph Lauren polo camel color, that really is amazing. And David, really you fabulous. buy this now. Please promise me at home you will never, ever, ever donate it or give it away because it is oh. never, ever, ever, ever out going style. out of oh, style. Oh, no. C capes have been around never. since the 1920s yeah. and 30s. I always Women think of Rosalind chic. Russell. Like, oh, just yes, fantasize. yes, yes. Anti Main. <laughs> yep, there I am. I will awesome. not start singing. Um, but we do want to take a moment or two. In fact, David, we're going to get our miles in. Let's go back. Yeah. Here's the brooch that you see on Blair, and this actually is brand new today. It's from the private collection, so it has a beautiful box that David is running to get. I'm just the grab. easy pay is gone at the end of the day. So David, if someone is new, can you talk to us about sure. Joan's private collection? So the private collection, and I was just with Melissa last Monday and Tuesday yeah. in Los Angeles. The private collection is, we're going back into Joan's, literally into Melissa's vaults, and we're finding pieces that were Joan's personal favorites, things that she wore when she was entertaining, things that she wore on the red carpet, of course, or on Fashion Police, or things that she wore on The Tonight Show 30 years ago. And we're recreating those faithfully. We're bringing out pictures and videos and, you know, parts of Joan's life where she's wearing them. And it all kind of dovetails to Melissa's new book, mm -hmm. Joan Rivers Confidential, which mm -hmm. is, which is uh, this month, coming published this month. But this is a pin with a great history for us. Signer, the famous Signer Jewelry Company, which Joan wore exclusively before she started here at QVC. That was her fashion jewelry of choice. They're the oldest fashion jewelry company in America. We're partnering with them, and these pieces are hallmarked Signer for Joan Rivers. Wow. They have never done that before. We've never collaborated with anyone before. But the idea of marrying Joan's favorite fashion jewelry line before she created her own favorite fashion wow. jewelry line, and that's what pieces like this are. They're from the Signer archive. They're exquisite. They're just beautiful. Craftsmanship off the chart. You're not